Hi, okay, so I'm going to be talking about BB and um, how the superego and id um, affect the product offerings for this company and how consumers change their shopping habits based on it. So I looked at the brand and it appears to be high quality, they're known by their name. Um, the products are expensive and seem to appeal to a young demographic. The homepage of their website even shows popular figures of um, popular celebrities uh, wearing their clothing on Instagram from Instagram. So there's a huge like young cultural factor to it. So because of this, I can see connections that I can apply the products and the company based on the id and the superego to BB. The, pro the brand can be attributed to the id because it describes the primitive aspects in life. So the I id is your desire, and many women use shopping to express their desires as to how they look, but also because shopping is a, a desire to relieve stress. Culturally, it's a very important um, aspect, not to everyone, but like t but to a lot of women. And um, BB is obviously one of those places that they go. So the super ego can be related to purchasing products at this brand as well. Um, since the super ego relates to the ideal self, um, people shopping at this store are there because they want to look like the models or the influencers who are wearing the brand. Back to the Instagram posts, the, the website, the company put up um, of Instagram of the popular women wearing it kind of like feeds into that as a marketing tactic to get the consumer's super ego acting up and getting them wanting or influencing them to want to look like the people who are popular and like who are something. Um, I don't think that consumers of this brand utilize the id or the super ego over the other. I think the ego does create a balance between the two. It regulates and considers social norms. So shoppers for this brand know what product they would want to buy, for what occasion, um, and the price point that they're willing to spend. Uh, I think the ego determines that. The id and the super ego kind of drive the fact that they're there, but this ego is going to regulate them um, so that they don't spend all their money at this store or um, and keeps them grounded from those unattainable like unattainable feelings that they want to look exactly like those models who are wearing the brand keeps you kind of with yourself. Um, rather than thinking that you can be looking like someone else. So it's very important when shopping at this brand and creates a balance between the other two, which is completely necessary. Thank you.